What's up everybody, I'm John Dornboss. Welcome to Talent University and I am here to show you a sick card trick on how you can have your friends, family, doesn't matter, pick a card and find it in a really cool way. So, will you be uh, kind enough to help us out? All right, all I want you to do is reach in here and pull one out. Now hold on, hold on, I don't want to see it. So I'm gonna turn around. Okay, show everybody, you got it? Okay, uh, put it right here. Now here's the deal, um, I'm gonna try and find this thing. But here's what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show the cards and I'm gonna turn them on the table like this. Just think of your card and think about the number, the color, the suit, and everything about it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think that the next card I turn over is gonna be your card. No, you're not even giving me a shot. All right, here it is, are you ready? Name your card out loud. There it is, the next one I turn over is yours. So that's a way to do what we call a bait and switch. They think you messed up, but instead, bam, you come in right where it doesn't count, find her card, everybody goes nuts, you get the round of applause that you've always wanted, and then pretty much exit right there because it's hard to follow that one. So here's all you need to do this trick. Any deck of cards, can be red, can be blue, can be, it doesn't matter. Any deck of cards, they're not a trick deck, it's not marked. These cards can be shuffled by your friends, it doesn't matter, they can shuffle them. Uh, but you're gonna need somebody to pick a card out. Uh, here you go, uh, pull one out. And then I want you to, now look, see what I do is this. I go, look, I'm gonna turn around so I can't see it, but when I turn around, this is a behind the camera view. I do this. And I look at the bottom card and that's how I know. So it would look like this. You got the card, I'm gonna turn around, and look at this, I glimpse that bottom card, which is this two of hearts, and then I come back. So now what I'm gonna do is just kinda lift off a section of cards off the top, and put it on the top, and then you're gonna basically cut the cards, so that the card that I know, the two of hearts that was on the bottom, is now gonna go on top of their chosen card. And now all we're gonna do is look, just turn the cards face down. And I'm still looking for my two, so look at this. Ah, oh, ah, oh, what's this? There's my two right there, which means I know this is their card. So if you want, kinda kick it out to the side a little bit, and then keep going, right? So there we go. And then, and then, oop, we're gonna, all right, tilt it. I, I got it, I got it. They're gonna look at you and be like, no. Oh, no, 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 don't tell me what it was. I'm gonna stick with my gut here. I bet you that the next card I turn over, and notice I'm doing this, because I'm selling the fact that they think I'm turning this card over, which we all know is wrong. And I remembered that I put their card down right here. So you kind of come back here. Ah, you thought you got me. You reach on the table, you pick up their card, say, name your card, four diamonds. And you're like, there we go. Like I said, the very next card I turn over is yours. And there you go. See, in magic, you want to take them on an emotional journey. So they pick a card, you lose it, and guess what? They think you failed, you're miserable, you're awful, and then you come back with a whammer. Dude, it makes the trick awesome, and they remember it. So I hope you enjoy that. Now, please practice, practice, practice. Go perform it, and then tell us how you're doing. I want you to video this performance. I want to see it, but you're going to hashtag Talent University. Hi everybody, I hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe right here for more.